Hey, remember this one? Well, there was a, a little something that uh, I never really did. Remember, I only did this one after I got the bar, because it was kind of helping me with balance and whatnot. Let's see how I can do it now without... <clears throat> exactly. <laughs> so, possession on difficult. Super, super jumpy chart, even on difficult, because the jumps are this song's signature pattern, I guess you could say. So, uh, at this portion, just kind of getting you into the rhythm of things. There's nothing really difficult about it. All just flow right together without any sort of issue. Then it slows down. And then you gotta watch your timing. Yeah, it's the same speed as before, but it, it just seems slower because it looks slower. <laughs> but since you're using eighth notes instead of just fourth notes, you're gonna... It's one of those sorts of speed up, slow down trickery. And here comes the step jump patterns, but this is the portion that's probably gonna give you the most issue. <laughs> At least in doing it barless. Although I have seen yep, some even people has its signature jumps on difficult. Yeah, it's I have seen some people do it barless by oh, preference. <laughs> but the thing about it is that that's not my preference. <laughs> but yet I still have a bone to pick with this chart because I never passed it without using the bar. Because after I got the bar, I just kind of was like, eh, eh, I passed it. <laughs> But here I am retrying it without the bar, now that I remember that I was indeed working on this at one point without the bar. So now we're gonna go do the jumps at the corners once again. It's I got I got them a, a little bit better for the most part there, but when they start getting all over the place, time to cheese the heck out of the <laughs> ending. <laughs> ah, that'll do. <laughs> Yeah, I wasn't sure if I could pull that off with my uh, current balance level, so I just tried that. <laughs> Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later.